Today we're going to be testing the stability of the Grizzly electric height adjustable workbench. Stick around to find out the results and see for yourself just how sturdy the Grizzly is. Hi, I'm Bill Knighton with Right Angle Products. In this video, I'm going to be using our wobble meter to test and find out the stability of the Grizzly height adjustable workbench. The test will look at both side to side movement and front to back movement. For the first part, we're going to test the Grizzly side to side movement. We're going to do this at 5, 10, and a 15 pound pull test at three different height positions. Then we're going to test the front to back movement at a 5 and 10 pound pull test. At the end of the video, we will look at the final scores and I'll share with you my thoughts on the table stability level. Then you can decide for yourself if the Grizzly is a good fit for you. Before we jump in, here are some of the details about the Grizzly electric height adjustable workbench. The travel range is 23 inches to 48 and a half inches without a work surface. The base has a lifting capacity of 265 pounds. That includes the weight of your work surface. So if your top weighs 100 pounds, the Grizzly can now lift 165 pounds of materials on the workbench. The Grizzly base is also expandable. The table width ranges from 43 inches to 74 and 5 8 inch. It includes a three button digital control switch, it comes standard with a one-year warranty. It looks to be made in China. Lastly, we purchased this for $439.95 plus shipping. We have the Grizzly workbench set at 27 and a half inches. We're gonna do our five pound, our 10 pound, and our 15 pound pull test. So here's our five, 10, 15. Now we'll test the Grizzly workbench at 39 inches high at five pounds, 10 pounds, and then 15. Here's the five pound, 10 pound, and 15 pound. Okay, now we'll be testing the uh, Grizzly workbench at uh, 46 and a half inches, five, 10, and 15 pounds. So here's five. 10 and 15. For the left to right wobble, the Grizzly scored in the excellent to very good to good range for the first two height positions, but landed in the good to fair range at 46 and a half inches. So everybody likes to see just kind of general pushing on the table, putting a little pressure on it, maybe you're sanding on it, working on it, but you're gonna see this, it doesn't take much for this table to really move around a lot. Now we're gonna test the Grizzly front to back stability for a five and 10 pound pull test. We'll start at a height of 27 and a half inches. Five. And 10. All right, now we'll be testing the Grizzly workbench at 39 inches, front to back, five and 10 pound. Five. 10. Now we're going to test the Grizzly workbench on the front to back movement and this is set at 46 and a half inches. So here's 5 pounds and 10 pounds. For the front to back wobble, the Grizzly scored in the excellent range for the first two height positions and in the very good to good range at 46 and a half inches. As you can see from the results, the Grizzly workbench in the low settings was fairly stable. When you get into the higher settings, you can see from the wobble meter and just the hands-on testing, it's pretty unstable when you get into that 46, 44 to 45 inch height range. So if you're gonna be doing a lot of things that require a lot of sanding and movement back and forth, um, I'm not sure if it'll be the perfect fit for you, but that's a decision you have to make. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.